everybody, it's Pam with Tattered Paper and Lace. Welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another week of Marguerite Miller's collage, 52 week collage challenge and we're on week 33. So I appreciate you coming along. I'm going to show you what I've done. Love for you to comment, let me know what you think. And again, we are on week 33. So what we needed this week was electronic, whatever that means to you, a security envelope pattern, something with a star or stars, a doodle, something industrial, and text from a book page. So let me show you my collage. Here is my collage. So, Something electronic to me is anything that takes electricity to make it work. So, I am using this microphone for that. Something, um, a security envelope in the background. I have gotten a couple of envelopes that are craft colored with the security uh, pattern on the inside. So that's what I have in the background here. Uh, something with a star or stars so I, I had punches for these stars and I did uh, doodle around those and then I have this metallic looking star here that came from the Dollar Tree and that was a sticker uh, then the doodle is around the stars plus I have done some faux writing uh, with my fountain pen here which I'm going to consider doodle as well something industrial is this this stacks that look like factory, like it's a factory or something. Uh, and then the text book from a text, a text from a book page is my background. And then I've just added a couple of stamps there because I, I thought it needed something else. Uh, so that is my, my collage for this week. Um, I, I like this one a lot um, and thought it turned out pretty well. Now, I just wanted to make a comment about this industrial piece of metal over here that I just used as a little embellishment over here. That is a piece of aluminum foil uh, colored with alcohol inks. So if you're interested in seeing how that is done, uh, give me a comment as to um, whether you'd like to see that or not. I'm going to be doing a steampunk uh, journal and so I have been playing with and there's another piece of tin foil and it's I used the less shiny side of the tin foil on that I also used the less shiny side of the tin foil on that so I'm practicing let me show you a couple of other things um, this piece is already mounted to a piece of cardstock and then I have a butterfly butterfly and a frame and one other thing I have under here somewhere excuse me I've got I've got my piece of card board on top here so I have this lease as well as this fencing it looks like a chain link fence so if you are interested if you'd like to know how I do that, uh, leave me a comment and I will do a tutorial on, on coloring uh, aluminum foil with alcohol inks to make it look sort of like, I don't know, forged metal that's like leftovers and, you know, from, from a project or something that was being made, sort of like the slag glass that's the end of day glass that's left over. This is one I'm considering the end of day metal left over from when it's when it's been forged and to be made into something. So if you're interested, let me know. But let me know what you think about my collage and I will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.